Hello everyone and welcome to our I Pick My Butt video on moresurvivor.io and if you saw the video from the other day with the revival effect, well, you know now that we don't get any increase to our attack or even our movement speed once we die. But what does it actually do? I just kind of assumed that it was giving us a larger portion of our health, but that's not necessarily true either. For testing on this, we're going to be going in with catnips and seeing what the healing does in those rings with and without the revival effect. And we'll also be grabbing our food too, seeing if there's any difference in that. And we're also gonna be seeing if we can check how much we're actually healing up when we die and then revive. Now I will say when it comes to the dying and reviving, it looks like there's a cap amount of about 80K. So even with over 100K in hit points, I had to reduce down my actual stats just in case we were able to see any change in that number. And unfortunately, it didn't matter how many times I died, I still saw 55k every single time. So when it came to the healing portion of this, with the revival effect on, we were healing for 330 with catnips at one star. And when it came to collecting food, we were getting 37k from one piece of meat. So without the revival effect, we're throwing the army belt on and I'm just leveling it up a couple of times to get it as close as I can to that 55023, which you can see we're pretty close, 55028. And you can see going in, we'll grab our Medi drone again. And where we were getting 330 with the revival, we're only getting 275. So there is definitely a reduction there. So the revival is going to affect the actual healing inside the game. And when it came to the food, we were only getting 31k. So I will say I did grab the energy drink in both runs, and I was seeing an increase in that too. And I imagine if you are a katana user, well, the healing of that might give you an increase also. So if you are a catnips user or even a katana user, this might be something that really benefits you. But for everybody else, this is something that's not looking too good for us besides the extra percentage of health we're going to get from these S grade items. And before I forget, I want to thank Bubble Z for letting me know about this. You definitely made my life a lot easier for figuring this out and it finally put some closure to it. I'm really curious to know what you guys are going to do. If you're not using catnips or even using the katana, are you going to continue to use an S grade belt for that extra HP percentage? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to join the Discord, like, subscribe, and remember, I pick my butt.